Hey everyone, thank you for joining us for Tea with the Supremes. We have a lot of interesting, um, authentic, deep conversations about issues of social justice and things related to mental health. And we all come from very different backgrounds and different areas of the country, um, different perspectives. So we figured it would be amazing to, to share our conversations with our listeners. We accept the love we think we deserve. So you took the couples um, one and the relationship that was prominent mm -hmm. in your mind was that of your children and not your husband? It's important to have an understanding of what your love language is. And little did I know, all I had to do was just sit in a damn room with him and watch him play Fortnite. How then do we justify death? Black or not, it's, it's inconceivable the way that he handled it. I think that opens up the conversation of, are we giving our officers enough training? How can you invalidate everyone? I don't need to matter more. I need you to understand that I matter. White privilege is a very volatile phrase. Be mindful, be self-aware, be accepting. I needed to put in the work to be a better ally. Why is it appropriate to dictate that natural hair is not professional hair? Don't be afraid to be uncomfortable. The parents have way more authority in school than they should. This is the boundary. You've crossed it. Now you need to walk yourself over to the other side. I did not have a voice because children were to be seen and not heard. I was entitled to the same kind of authority and respect as male counterparts. Uh, take into account that relatives can be predators just the same. And I found my voice within my growth and I'm not mad at it. Yay! <laughs> I'm a girl of the podcasting. <laughs> Keep listening and check us out next week.